It's when you break his commandments. Oh. So I put that down. Let me get that for you. Somebody told me God loves sin. No, he said, it's in there. That it says that um, he hates sin, but he loves the sinner. No, nope, he hates both of them. He said he would not hear the prayers of a sinner. So he hates both of them. What well, they saying, yeah, he loves, he hates what you sin, but he loves the sinner. No, he doesn't. Why? Because sin is a transgression of the law. You break it. Thou shalt not kill. Thou shalt not steal. Thou shalt not murder, should I say. See? See that? See? He died for the sin. Sin. Yeah. <laughs> you see that? You, 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 listen, that's why the Bible says you crucify Christ afresh every time you go out here and break his commandments. That's the book of Hebrews. You can't do, keep doing. The Bible says, shall we sin because of grace? They put grace in your face, right? The Mo Roman said, I'm almost done. He said, he got an ear. The Mo Bible says, the most high forbid. So you can't keep doing what you're doing, that the most, breaking the commandments just because he died on the cross. He sent his son to die on the cross. You can't do that. That's not what he died for. You understand that? That means people, <laughs> you do now good. You can't go out there and say, oh, I'm going to go kill, I'm going to go murder this person, and tomorrow I'm going to get down, tonight I'm going to get on my knees and ask forgiveness in Christ's name. Ain't gonna listen, listen to that. He ain't going to hear it. He may send somebody to take you out the same night. Because <laughs> he's, um, uh, he's stepping it up big. Okay, let's get it. I-U-I-C-C-G-M-S. Sakari Dagger.